Welcome, everyone, to Trick and Dare 2, part 2. That's right. I am finishing up this wad. Late. Again. So, uh, yeah, let's just load game. Over a year. Feed. Like the glowing. Love the map name. And I don't like these decorations. How they have collision. That's just something I've noticed for this one. Enter Contour 1. Everything's dead. And it's a death bear level. We got some sigil cracks. Mm, crack. Damage. Shut up. His blood is dark. Ah. Oh, fucking kill. Oh, it's slow to spare. Kind of. It is! Oh, I'm being surrounded! Secret fight. Neat. It was summer of slaughter type beat. I hear you. Bite the hand that feeds, baby. Huzzah. 
Oh, so it's not a hand. It's kind of a hand. Emulates a hand. It's the beautiful one. I can't do awesome. Shut the luck up. Me of 13. It's a beautiful map. I love hook out maps like this. If I made this game. This game being Doom 2, I would give the pan elemental a melee attack. I don't know what it would look like or what he'd be able to do. Like, would he punch you? He could, he could bite you potentially. I think biting would be a good option. But. Unsure. Thank you. Why would you do this to me, Bear? Don't get a lot of plasma action in this.
Yikes. Ew. Ew. Mm, driving my car. So slow, the door. This gun shot twice as fast, it'd be good. does deserve a secret. Let's look. No backtracking. Burn. Backtracking! Beautiful. Death Bear! You do know this map? Yeah, who made this? Mapper named. Is this a bottom level? Decided to go to work tomorrow. Actually, I've uh, ooh, reached some major milestones in my. Uh, I, I I I finished a document finally. How do I get to you? How do I get to you? How am I supposed to get up there? Huzzah! 
Skull and hole. Oh wait, I had a BFG. That's all the enemies. Cool. Fuck this rocket. Fuck this ammo too. Beautiful. Unhallowed con. I believe this map has a great opening. It does! I don't want to kill these guys. This is like dusk. Yeah, if I just run through here, the music stays on, right? Aww. I'll play the map as intended. Fine. Oh, I have acne. This is like an anniversary. Mirrors are more fun than television. Girl, I'm lagging. It's back.
I'm back. I hear you in there. There's going to be a arch foe around the corner. Oh, honey, don't say that on stream. I'm gonna be here for a while. Damn it. Working as intended, I, I see. I hear DAC Ray. That's just mean. A revenant? Oh, not, not this guy. I'm getting dizzy playing this. I guess I should wake up right now. Hate these little souls. trap. God, this is hard.
Wait. Kinds of turned around right now. Oh. Inhumane. I got him. Inhumane. This level is inhumane. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. One way to deal with it. Batman, Batman. I, if I made this level, which I didn't, I would add a thing where like, I would just add random monster sounds to line deaths or like monster wake up sounds so like I cross this line and I just hear in the distance Rah! you know nothing spawns Let's get the fuck out of here sandwiched oh uh, boys 65 Four years in the energy pits of love, baby. Oh, wait, it was a 
four years or months. Four years. Bobbing for apples. Seems to be in every hell. Yeah. Bobbing for apples. <gasps> God, I'm gonna need five mega spheres if I'm gonna fight these guys. Not to deal with the health loss, but to deal with the trauma. Ooh. God, there's a wad you should check out. I think you may have seen it before. Am I moving? I am. It's called a. Uh, uh, I, don't, I don't remember what it's called, but it's like, uh, it's based off of an album called Everywhere Everywhere at the End of Time. And it's like, it's the first episode of Doom, but every level slowly just degrades. As, like, Doom Guy, like, uh, his brain, uh, falls to dimension. I think you'd really get a kick out of it. Yes! Oh, you know what? I forgot I could do this. Jump in the text. The voice, Charco. I am in the voice. Come speak to me. In the podcast. I love this pentagram. It looks very sly. I should not be using my gay vernacular. That shit special. They serve for my people. I don't want the Doom guys using it. My olden. We trick and we tear it. And we're anding. Don't forget the and of the trick and tear. Everybody always does. <laughs> it's the most important part. Yeah, it keeps us it keeps it all together. Yeah, exactly. Which map are you on? Uh bottoms first. Nice. Does I my love the candle pencil I know, it's so great. Does my stream say trick and tear or does it say speed squared still? Uh, it says tricking and tearing, yeah. Beautiful. Until it is done. The water. Trick and tear. Trick and tear. That is such a great cold open. I'm, 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 I'm doing a. I haven't done it or uh, kept up with it for a while, but I was doing a playthrough of the whole Doom series. Oh yeah. On YouTube, yeah. I may, I may switch that over to a stream thing and then like, you know, 
upload my video. But the, uh, I played the first three episodes of Doom. I have not played that flesh consumed yet. Well, I have, just not on camera. Right. Um, I really want to play Doom 2 again. It's been ages since I've played that game. Oh, yeah. I don't really remember the levels all that well. But then after Doom 2, I'm gonna play Doom 64 for the first time ever. Ah, oh, dude, Doom 64 is so good. Yes, and then Doom 3. Aw, oh, Doom 3 is also good. I like Doom 3. I know a lot of people, uh, I don't know. I, I, I wouldn't say it's an unpopular opinion to like Doom 3, but a lot of people didn't like it. It's a black sheep. But I think it's good. I like it. I played, I played Doom 3 like when it came so excited for it. Oh. I liked it so much. Alright, we're, we're just having this casual conversation and shit's hitting the fan on the map. I, I see that. Like, it, it's get, it's getting crazy. I was not expecting this. But Cotton usually has a, a light hand when it comes to monsters. But this is actually rather frightening. Yeah. Have you been watching Meaner's uh, Summer Slaughter stream? Um, I have not. Oh. I, uh, I haven't been able to. to I need to pop in there at some point, but I had to, I had to be in the office earlier this week, so I wasn't really able to. Yeah, I, I, I can kind of, like, sneak my phone, with, like, it's easy for me to, like, browse Twitter at work, but, like, I can't watch a stream. Well, usually, if, when I'm able to watch streams at work, I just fucking open up Twitch on my work computer. Our, uh, monitors, cor but, um, corporate internet blocks it. Oh, does it? That sucks. Yeah. But, um, but now this week I just had stuff going on. Just like, end of, uh, end of year stuff, you know what I mean? Yeah. You work for NASA, right? Uh, yes. Nice. And I'm sure, I'm not sure if I should reveal that one. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's fine. Like, just dogs to you. Uh, it's it's one of those things where like um, I, it's not like a big deal that people know about it, but you don't really want to go around talking about it a ton because it can make you a target for like espionage and stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then, believe it or not, that's like a that's a problem. Yeah, no, I, I'd imagine. I mean, it's a fucking government yeah, organization. So you, know, you don't want to like I like like I, on my like I don't have my job listed on my Facebook page. That's totally reasonable. Who's the last guy? Are those sectors all like sector lighting? I'm pretty sure, yeah. I have a. a I, this, cool. I have dynamic lights on right now. Well, I'm just talking about on the auto map, there's like around where those lights are, there's like those like diamond shapes. Oh, in, in here? The, in the cavern area to the east. You this? Go the auto map. Yeah, these diamonds are uh, sector lights. Yeah, I don't. That's I love sector lighting. This area was like a Hall of Mirrors. Oh, that was the Hall of Mirrors. Okay, I haven't played this yet, but I remember him showing off the Hall of Mirrors. It's really cool. He did a he did a map just like it for anniversary. That's awesome. <sighs> At midnight's hour. But really? When is it ever midnight, really? Wait? <laughs> Plasma start. That's so cool how it's like a continuation of the previous level. Yeah, the Picotum trilogy. That's awesome. I love the way this room looks. It kind of reminds me of the the purple pentagram room that he made. Mm -hmm. From for what? Yeah. Uh, from uh, from Top Secret Project number number three. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I need to I need to <laughs> I need to update my map for that. Like I I want to kind of overhaul it. I mean that's fine. I I need to update the resource still. Do, yeah, I'm I'm. Woo! Is this a motivator? It is a motivator. That's cool. It's like from Wipeout. Oh, that's cool. I wonder if this right. is good. this is like Arch Rival. I'm on a okay, so. I would stream on Discord as well, but I think that. How did you do that? That would probably tank. It would, and it fucks up recording. It like it just gets rid of sound. That happened, I think, to the, the Mayan recordings. Let me 
Madness. I was actually thinking about uh, Mysterious Mind Madness earlier in the day. It, that, that has some really good levels in it. It does. Yeah. It's a good little set. Really, I really want to finish mine. I don't want this. I like the way this. I like the way this stuff is textured. Like, it, it's just like uh, it keeps cycling through the like different like rocky textures and that kind of color. Like all these different colors and stuff. Hello, boys. I'm excited to get to work on this. I almost have two enemies finished for that. Nice. I, I'm gonna start messing with uh, the Hell Knight, like you had mentioned. The Baron? The Baron? Or the Baron. Yeah, I'll, I'll mess with him and see if I can cook up something that you think looks nice. Yeah. I, I don't want... Out, that's fine. I want to try to avoid just doing a lot of recolors. Yeah. Um, Beth, Beth needs to finish his second map. Uh, he plays when I s yeah, I hate to change the topic again, but Meaner always plays either when I'm at work or when I'm asleep, and then his VODs don't upload, which is unfortunate. Yeah, that is unfortunate. For this, I wanna, like, I'm fine with having some recolors, like the Cyber Demon. Like, that's a big sprite. Mastermind. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, for things like the Baron, like, if we could get away with changing it in some manner to make it look like it's from a different part of hell. Oh yeah, really absolutely. Cool. I, I think like, as far as sprite work goes, like, making it so it doesn't have eyes is probably like, something I could pull off. But anything much more complicated than that, I'd probably be mm -hmm. drastically under-equipped. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I, I'm, I'm hoping I can get the Hell Knight and Archfell done. Archfell's gonna be a bitch. Oh. Archfell has a lot of, lot of frames. Also, um, Caleb from Blood just spoke to me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I wish I, I, I wish I could hear the stream. Uh, yeah. I killed I killed a hellhound and he went good doggy. <laughs> I, nice. I I I still need to play Blood. I I bought it on a summer sale a while back. One moment. Uh, oh. Blood is great. One moment. I'll be right back. <laughs> Sorry. I, uh, I had to, I had to make sure my roommate didn't turn the AC off. Because I, I was burning up. Oh, so, did you ever hear the fiasco with my desk? The fiasco with your desk? I don't believe so. Um, I went to Ikea when I moved into my apartment. I got a bed. I got a TV stand. Um, my roommate got some other shit. I got a desk. It was like a... Ooh. A standing desk that I could, uh, like, press a button and it would become, a, like, a sitting desk, right? Oh, I've always wanted one of those. I got the top. The top, I'm looking at it right now. It's in a big cardboard box in, at the other end of my living room. And the bottom, they said, like, hey, uh, here's a piece of paper. Go scan this at checkout, and then we'll go, like, into the warehouse and pick it up for you. I'm like, okay, that's fine. I can do that, right? So I do that. I give them, well, my grandmother pays for it. And we, we unload all of the shit we bought, which is like this kitchen table, a bunch of chairs, four chairs for the kitchen table. It's like cheap, metal chairs, um, TV stand, and the bed, the tabletop, the desktop. And then I, I remember, I'm like, oh shit, I gotta take this paper to the warehouse. I go to the warehouse, I'm like, hey, here's my, uh, I, I want the rest of my desk. And the guy's like, okay, I'll go pick that up for you. It'll be like 10 seconds. Guy comes back and says, oh, yeah, we don't have that. We paid for it. So, no so desk. You paid, you paid for a desk that you didn't get. Did they refund you? Yeah, yeah, that, that was a whole nightmare, too, because, like, half of it was cash. Real pain in the ass. But um, I looked online today because I was like, you know, I'm kind of sick of playing video games in my living room. Or my kitchen. I'm, or, or not, I don't really play video games, but doing my hobby stuff like Doom, sprite work, everything. I, I don't want to do that in my kitchen. I yeah. wanna I wanna be in my room, right? What the hell? Oh Jesus! So I just went on IKEA.com and I looked, 
and it, I the desk, like the whole desk, was available. And I said, hey, you could buy the whole desk with the top and everything, for like 500 bucks. I'm like, ugh, I don't really want to get the whole thing, you know? I just want to get the piece yeah. I need. I look at the piece I need, not available. Right? Not av it, the, the closest availability was in Atlanta, Georgia, which is like a four-hour drive for me. And that was not about that. So, I'm like, fuck, all right, what will I, I could, what, what am I going to do? So, I was about to call to see, like, how they could help me. And then it hit me. I'm like, wait a minute, what if I try a different color? So, I just swapped the color from white to black, which you know, I'm not crazy for, but it's at the bottom of my desk. I'm not going to really look at it. Right. And it's like, oh yeah, it's available. You can like ship it to your house. I'm like, oh cool. It was like <laughs> delivery fee. It was like fifty bucks. I'm like, fuck it. It's gonna get here next week. And okay, then I was cool. like, wait a minute. If it's available for pickup, why don't I just not pay the delivery fee and just go pick it up tomorrow? So I'm going to go get a desk tomorrow, which I'm very happy for. And then I need to get a dresser because I do not have any room in my closet for all of the sh my fucking pants and underwear. Dude, that's the <laughs> that's the best part about like you getting your own place is finding out about all the stuff that you need that you don't have. Yeah, it's it's and then having to work around that for the next couple of weeks. It's 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 a lot because my my closet is a wreck right now. My or. We, we just got our washer and dryer this week, and uh, the dryer doesn't work. <laughs> so we're getting a new dryer tomorrow, and I'm going to finally be... I have, like, two weeks' worth of clothes. Like, maybe two weeks and a half worth of clothes just sitting in my uh, laundry bag, just tipping over, just getting everywhere in my room's a mess. It's it's a lot. I, I've, I actually, like, spent a good deal of time today just... Not cleaning my room, but just like there's a bunch of stuff I hadn't unloaded, like a big box full of sweaters and then, uh, like a bunch of like Warhammer stuff that I was like, alright, I could just find, I could take it out of the box, find a better place for it, like throw the box away, and just have room. So yeah, I did that, which is really nice. I uh, but like. All of my underwear, all of my pants, and everything just kind of sit on top of my closet on this like shelf. They're not really easy to get to, but I at least I, I have a lot of room in my room now, which is nice. There's not like just boxes everywhere. I feel kind of dumb for putting that off for so long because it's just it, I like my brain feels like it can breathe now. Yeah, I know exactly what you mean about like yeah putting stuff off and then doing it being like. Why didn't I put that off for so long? Mm -hmm. Are those still good? Still mm. Yeah, I mean, go for it. Uh, yeah, like, oh shit. Definitely, like, I. I'm going to be going home this weekend, and I think my sister had a dresser that she, like, she just recently got, like, bought a house. Yeah. And there, I think that there's a dresser that she just left at our home that she doesn't want anymore, so I'm hoping I can cop that. So I can have something to, I like, I like how this is, I didn't notice that I had a dresser. Free furniture is the best furniture. Oh god, yeah. No, well, what's crazy to me too? Like, have you? Do, do you have a a store called the Habitat Restore near you? Whoa. That, uh, yeah, yeah, we have those. I uh, the yeah. Uh, I mean, I think it's called the Habitat Restore. It's just you like know, it's a Goodwill for furniture. Yeah, yeah, we have the restore. Yeah. The uh, I I went there a few weeks ago, and there's I got a coffee table. I'll send you a picture of it right now. I'll put it in the. The big four. Um, that coffee table over there. You can kind of see a guitar behind it for scale, kind of. Oh, that's going to be another thing. Just being able to play guitar in my room. Um, that coffee table was like... 
150 bucks maybe 100 wow. bucks maybe it was cheap a it's table a what it's a nice coffee table thank you thank you it's a little scuffed up but i mean i got it for like pretty cheap yeah the, at ikea there's a coffee table that's like a quarter of the size for like 200 bucks <laughs> Yeah, IKEA stuff is like uh, supposed to be pretty cheap generally. Yeah. So it's kind of crazy that it's like I don't know that much more expensive. Yeah, it's it it, it is kind of like, like compared to just buying it like used. IKEA is like kind of expensive, but like yeah. compared to other stores, it's still oh, yeah. like dirt cheap. What is okay? What is happening in this room? Um, Are it's you, like, swimming. Yeah, it's like underwater, low gravity. Okay, that's wild. I do appreciate the crazy shit the cotton does with uh, EDMF. I'm not I'm not a huge EDMF guy, but this is it's always interesting seeing just oh, ab yeah. abstract abstract fights. Which, by the way, I am 100% still down to do that. Wow. Auto aim. There's a I, I I've been wanting to do a you know the name of it. I'm not gonna reveal it. Oh, I know what you're talking about. But yeah, the an abstract art. Doom event. I think Mikado is going to take that event and become the mapper for it. There's always, for every event I've found, there's always one person who just like gets it. You know, they they understand the assignment and they make like either multiple or they make incredible maps for it. You know, yeah. Like uh, Deathbear did a Slay Watch. Which is just awesome. What I, what I, format is that project going to be in? UDMF, one hundred percent. Hey, I'm gonna need to do that with because I'm, I'm gonna have a hub that's gonna be an art museum, and then I, just, I want people to be able to just do whatever the hell they want. I my the rules as I am going to like. I mean, the, the rules are going to be based on the idea of trying to make the Sky Maybe not suck. The Sky Maybe. Is that the Archfile? No, not the, not the Archfile for sure. No. Sky Maybe. Sky Maybe is this weird, like, super weird abstract Doom Wad where uh, everything's just kind of wrong. But okay. not in, like, in, in like a jokingly stupid way. I, I'd recommend you look it up. It's really interesting. It, it's, 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 it's one of, like, it's a, it's a classic. It's up there with, like, Scythe and Hell Revealed, but it's, okay. like, uh, stupid. I'll have to, um, I'll have to check Whoa. that out. Um, but how would you feel if I made a, Whoa. Um, what the it was a giant spider. Oh, that is so cool. It was. The Weaver's um, Dream. Fl floating this by you, I don't know if this fits what you're going for, because I haven't quite nailed down exactly what that is yet. Um, how would you feel if I made a visual novel dating scene? That, that, would, that would fit it. That's perfect. Cool, because that's probably what I'm going to do. J just like... It's, it's going to be a nightmare. Yeah, like a, a a a dumb like every map shouldn't be like it could be a doom level. You know, they they're they're not they're not it's it's hard cuz they're not going to be really like rules for the event. It's just going to be like break the rules, you know. That's the rule. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm going to have time. For that. I'm going to have to use some custom resources. Do you And I and I may have to commission some artists. That's fine. Are you familiar with, uh... Oh, one of the rules. You can... You, in UDB, there's an option to make custom textures with sector art. Did you know that? I did not know that. Bridgeburner does this a lot. He does it for, like, pentagrams. You can draw a bunch of sectors 
um, give them textures and whatnot. Do like give it as much detail as you want, and then you can take that texture and then X or, or take all those sectors, select them, and then export it into UDB as a texture, like inside the map. Interesting. It's like it works like 3D floors where you have it in like a void space, uh -huh. and it just like reads the information from that and. That's cool. It's really cool. So, like, you could probably get away with just drawing the characters and having multiple emotions in sector art and then doing, like, just print text. That's an interesting idea. I'll have to look into that. I'll have to figure out how to do that. Look at the auto map. Learn that. Yeah, that, that, that's a good idea. <laughs> it's a spider. You're in Because you're inside the spider. Yeah. That's awesome. I'm arachnophobic, so this map sucks. <laughs> um... Let me. I'll. I'll. I'll, I'll gonna. Since I'm thinking about it, let me find it. Um, this is like this is like Slow of Despair, but good. Yeah. Oh, Death Bear had a map that was kind of like slow. Custom texture tutorial. Oh, um, I'm not gonna be able to find it, but on Bridgeburner's YouTube channel, he has or had. I don't know if he still does. He may. I don't. I don't know why he'd remove it, but he had a bunch of like tutorial videos, and one of them was on how to make. Uh... Oh, this this part's really cool. Make sure you check this out. Oh, it's a giant web. Whoa. No, that's in third person. <laughs> Hibernation's over. Yeah, I when I was looking at the auto map for map fifteen of this project, I thought it was another slow despair. Oh my god, he turned this into a Resident Evil game. I this is literally like red, like old school Resident Evil, like fixed camera. Stuff. I really want to see what he does for Trick and Tear Z. Oh, so I will give Picotum infinite amount of time. I will give him like five years to submit a map to Trick and Tear Z if he needs it. <laughs> I uh, Egregor. I'm interested to see what he does because he had a he had a map. What is Egregor hat? What is he map for? I know he did M Mayan Madness, but I don't remember his level all that well. I think his level was good. It's hard for me to remember. It's just been so long since I played that lot. I fucking did January. Oh! I was thinking to myself at work. But, like, I just had, like, the biggest... Well, not the biggest. I had a, a good moment of... Uh, I guess you could say catharsis. But I, I, I had a realization that all of the 2021 20, wads are finished. For puss. So, well, yeah, so like... Anniversary Under the Sea, Trick and Tear 2, 13. Uh, 12 Days of Doing This more actually it's just the only thing on our backlog now is like getting final versions for 2021 watts and then oh shit wrapping up 2022 and 2022 is just literally all of the uh, events are just I need to make my map for them and that's it I love just normally big open spaces don't work for me, but since the avenues, the places where you can walk are so small, it works because enemies just stay in like small lanes. You stay in small lanes, and they the projectiles just go everywhere. It's really cool. Yeah, no, it is very cool. I really like this. 
the I only... also appreciate that he made it so that when you fall off, you just get teleported back up and not instantly killed. I do wish you took damage, though. I think that'd be fair. Yeah, that'd probably be fair. But he keep you from... Because, like, as it stands, you could just, like, try to provoke a bunch of infighting and then just repeatedly jump off to, like, avoid getting hit by stuff. Mm -hmm. Um... But yeah, that would probably be a good change, but... It's too late for the change it's now. Such, it's such a, such a cool set piece. I think he should make that change for his second. Well, I mean, it's not really a second because it's not in order. But Mana Die, map 19 from Summer of Slaughter. I think he it has the same thing where you have like a big a circular arena that you can just jump off a platform and teleport back up. I think for Summer of Slaughter you should take damage. Teleported in. Oh man, I'm actually getting kind of sleepy. Dude, honestly, kind of same. <laughs> Big BFG ball. Oh. Oh, did, did you go out and vote yet? No, have you? Yeah. Oh, uh, I don't. I don't even know who's on the ballot. It doesn't matter. You know who to vote for. Yeah, any color you like, you know. Um, yeah, we do like early voting or whatever, so. And it's the midterms, so it's like there wasn't even that many people there. We, we were in and out in like 15 minutes. I'll see. I, I'm still registered in the county my school is in. Oh, you have to re register them? Yeah. I mean, my school is like 30 minutes away. I love the. Uh... Well, if you're, if you're in a different county, you gotta re register. Yeah. I love the. Uh... The wild pinkies. Have you seen this ending before? Wild pinkies roaming the plains. Is Nature true? is healing. Have you seen this ending? Uh, no, I haven't. Unmute the stream. Oh my god. You done it? Yeah, hang on. Go ahead. Break our tree! Yeah, that was Picatum. I remember he uh, sent out a big ask for everybody in the event headquarters to come re like record lines, and no nobody did it. Oh, fuck. I, I meant dude, to, but I forgot about it. Dude, I'm so bad about shit, man. Like, people... I, I have such a notoriously shitty memory. Mm. Like, someone asked me to do something, and then, like, an hour later, I've forgotten about it completely. That's me, dude. I, uh... I, like, yeah, I, I still need like, to get like, to... Those, like, I ones. attributed the name Lover's Quarrel to Picatum when Death Bear had come up with the name, and then I pitched it to Picatum. I couldn't have got it more oh, wrong. Oh, man. But, I, but, like, I just couldn't remember, like, where the <gasps> name had come from. Death Bear. Tragic. I'd leave it oh. in. Oh no! Pineapple under. This is our first credits map. Yeah? Yeah. Really? It is. Huh. Speed map was. or uh, Speed squared was added post hoc. Yeah, I was thinking like that would be a good bit for a mapper is if like uh, in every single one of your maps you hid a star tan texture somewhere where the player couldn't get. That would that would be cool. That'd be funny. Puss twelve trick <laughs> Roman numeral. They, they they don't work anymore on my brain. Trick and tear two. The only reason I'm good at Roman numerals is because of Final Fantasy. Mm. Project lead. Death Bear. Puss creator. Yeah, bitch. I've created Puss. <laughs> I love that entendre. I got the I got the plug puss. 
them both. Solus. Solus, Solus, Solus is great. I, uh... Solus, I, I, I was talking about this on last stream, he was... The Katamisa Miz, Mean Mind, Sotacha Morta, Few TV. Me! Death Bear. Weird Sandwich. Doomcat. Late that person. My old enemy. Dude, Weird Sandwich is such a good name. I, I know, it's great. Do you know what a Weird Sandwich is? Yeah. Ketchup and cheese. We, we, we put it on the, uh, we put it on the, uh, the iceberg. Yep. Can't wait to eat one of those. I, I wanted to do that uh, for. Uh, I wanted to do that for the anniversary stream, which I never uh, did. Uh, why would you do that? Why would you eat that? Because it's why a weird sandwich. It's a weird sandwich. It is a weird sandwich. Which is funny, because like, okay, like, you put both those things on a burger. Yeah. And it's totally normal, but you take away the the meat. And suddenly it's. Have you seen this credit spot before? I think I've seen parts of it. I I, I feel like I've seen screenshots oh, of it, I but area. I haven't seen it like in map. Happy Halloween! Oh, something I'm gonna do for Trick and Terror Z. When you launch the game, you'll have the option to start two episodes. One will be Hordes of Halloween, which will take you to the hub map of RC1, and then there will be. Episode 2, Resurrection, which will be the RC2 levels, which I'll have a separate hub. Oh, cool. But both uh, both hubs will have an exit that takes it to the other hub. That way you can just jump jump across episodes. But each... The, the second secret map, which is not going to be finished for a while, I have to add. The second secret map is going to have a secret exit to a credits map, which you can end the game from. So, thanks for playing, and for one final treat. Thirteen. I love thirteen so much. It's 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 top five. It's top three plus for me, really. Whoa! This scared the shit out of me. Oh, that was Trick and Terror 2. Glad to have finally beat it. I've played every 2021 WAD now. Nice. Well, YouTube people, thank you for stopping by. I'm going to wrap this stream up later. I'm going to do some fun shit. Well, to my viewers, but for YouTube, thank you for watching Trick and Terror 2. Mwah. Hugs and kisses. Say bye, my Alden. Bye-bye. Death Bear says bye in text. Peace.